Well, it was the ladies of Congress versus the women of the newsroom at this year's congressional softball game. But who claimed victory? Our Washington correspondent Kelly Meyer was there for all the action. <laughs> What happens when journalists and our elected officials finish their day? They go to play softball. It's always fun to play the members of Congress. It's always fun in the lead up, as much trash talking as possible. But that's so we drum up as much attention as possible to get people to come to the game and raise money for this good cause. The Congressional Women's Softball game has raised more than $500,000 for the Young Survival Coalition. That gives funds and awareness for young women who are diagnosed with breast cancer. It's doing so much to raise money and awareness for young breast cancer survivors. It just means the world to me. The women members of Congress were there supporting their team teammates on the hill. Talk about meet the press tonight, it's beat the press. And the men came out too. I'm out here rooting for Kirsten. She has a no, she has a shutout so far. So I hope when I leave it'll stay that way. The press traded their pens for a bat and the ladies of Congress stepped up to the plate, all playing for a good cause and had someone in mind that was affected by cancer. For me it's a great opportunity to honor somebody that I admire, that I respect for fighting the disease and that certainly is a young survivor. Christy Nome of South Dakota was playing for Lynn Popham of Haiti, South Dakota, diagnosed in December 2014. And Senator Kirsten Gillibrand of New York was playing for Lisa Danes from the upstate area. Fortunately, young women are taken every year to breast cancer, and we want to make sure they know to do breast exams, and we want to make sure they know that their breast health is really important. In the end, the women of Congress got the win, but the biggest thing they took away weren't the new friendships with one common goal in mind. It's a great um, night because it's an all in good spirit, uh, also, competitive, uh, but in friendship and for a good cause. It's fun, it's camaraderie, and we've really become good friends. Reporting in Washington, I'm Kelly Meyer.